What is up guys, it's Charles Gamer here. I'm coming with you to another GTA 5 online video. And in today's video, I'm going to be showing you the last and final VIP contract mission for Dr. Dre. And the mission is called Don't Fuck With Dr. Dre. Or Don't Fuck With Dre. Either way, very cool mission. Uh, we're going to get started here. So, once you go back to your agency and you find Franklin, you'll go to the, you know, the yellow circle. You'll go, he'll do his little thing. You'll make your way back into this car. And then you got to go find Jenny Guns' his last known location. So... Johnny Guns' last known location is going to be in this area, the map here. Um, at least this is where I found him. I don't know if it's the same every single time, but he'll go. He'll try and run into his nice little muscle car, and he's off to the horses. Now, you have to kill a couple of the guys to take out his hired gunman in order to advance to the next part where you have to go find him and chase him down. But you'll have a couple waves of cars that come. Probably about 30 guys you got to kill before it will allow you to uh, progress forward and find Johnny. Now, once you're done progressing here and you kill the guys, you're going to make your way to LSIA Airport. When you come in through, you're going to bang the left at the gate, and you're going to come to this hangar here, and it will prompt you to go through the side door. Now, keep in mind here, a lot of this is close quarters, like to the point once you get into the hangar, so, you know, shotgun would suffice to the start, or, you know, just be a badass and use an sorry rifle like here. Me, I did here. Uh, anyway, so once you do that, go ahead and make your way through the other hallway, and then you're gonna make your way inside the hangar. Now, inside the hangar, uh, there are some tankers that will blow up right away because uh, the guys will shoot them. So just be careful when you're in here because there are some different stuff that will explode spontaneously and kill you. Uh, fair warning: there is a airplane in the back that a car does come out of, so keep that in mind too. That a car does actually drive in here and it kind of hits you by surprise um so you'll see just keep in mind don't be stupid with it you can blow it up with an rpg not a big deal or you just choose the guys out up to you but i wanted to give you that guys for the fair warning there uh so once you do that you'll see here that the actually the plane that i am in is where that car will come out um there's a bunch more guys here and then so i got glitched out the first time i did this and johnny guns was actually frozen like it wouldn't progress the mission so if that does happen just go ahead and kill yourself and you'll uh respawn when you restart the mission just right outside this specific hangar you don't have to go through and find johnny guns again and stuff like that so if that happens there it is guys but so for the rest of this video it's mainly going to be a cutscene so i'm going to let the cutscene play out for you guys um so yeah i want to thank you guys so much for watching i hope you guys enjoyed this video uh, i hope to see you guys next on my channel and one last little tidbit at the end here uh after the cutscene you do have to drive dr dre to a, a certain area Hands off. Uh. Yo, Dre. Johnny. Uh, hold up, man. You took something that belongs to me. That's some bullshit. I got mad respect for you. Respect? What the fuck do you know about respect? Come on, man. You know me. You just tried to blackmail me. Uh, I had to hustle hard to get that thing, man. I was just trying to get paid. Listen, I'm sorry. I can wipe the files, track them down, track them, make this shit right on God. You just tried to kill me. But you know what? Let's forget about that for a minute. The track's in my phone. That shit leaked, my nigga. The shit is out there. There's no putting that genie back in the bottle. Johnny, do you think I'm a fucking dummy or something? Let me keep it real. Fuck you. And fuck you too, then. Watch your fucking mouth. Take your ass back to the golf course, motherfucker. This the streets. You way out your element, man. It's funny that you should say that because, uh, I got my clubs right here. And by the way, I like the 9-9. Nine -nine. That's my favorite. Never fails me, you know? It feels so sweet, so nice, and you can really get a hold of it. You know what I mean? Now, that's a great club. And I'll tell you what, man. Bitch! <laughs> ass! <laughs> motherfucker! <sighs> I don't even feel bad anymore. The demos are out there, and there's nothing I can do about it. And you know what? Turns out, hey, golf does put me in a better mood. All right, can you give me a ride home? I got something I want you to hear. Let's ride. Hey, listen. I feel like we've been through a lot together, yeah? But this shit, this shit right here, this put a lot of stuff in perspective for me. Jimmy was right. I've got
got to stop holding on too tight. I've got to start putting some of these demos out that I've been working on for so many years. You have no idea how much shit I've got. But you want to hear something? Okay. This is a world premiere right here, right now. And guys, that's going to be it. You're going to take him back to that country club, and he's gone. That's going to be it for this mission contract, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I hope to see you guys next time on my channel. I'm going to be out of here. Bye.